In this video, we are going to look at three ways that you can split columns in Power BI Power Query Editor. So I have some sample data here, and you can see in this first column here, which is our name column, we have a first and last name, but the data source has the first and last name together with no space. So one way we can split columns in this case is we can create a first and last name column, which is what we wanna do. So if we highlight the column just by simply clicking here, and then we click split column, we can actually split by lowercase to uppercase. So let's give that a try. Perfect, so it's separated the names. And then once we do that, we can right click on the column and we can rename the column so that our new column is now first name. And then our last name column, of course, we can rename to last name. Now let's take a look at our city column. We can see that our city column, the data came in with the name of the city and then a comma and then the abbreviated state. So what we can do is we can split that into a city column and a state column. So we can use the same split column button and then we can do split by limiter. And we can choose from a list of delimiters and comma is already chosen. So let's go ahead and do that at each occurrence of the delimiter and click okay. And now we've got our city column. And again, we can rename that just to city. And then we can rename the new column to state. Let's look at one more example. We have a zip code that came in and the zip code came in with a letter followed by the actual zip code. So we wanna get rid of that letter. One way we can do that is by splitting. And in this case, we can split by non-digit to digit. So let's give that a try. And that worked perfectly. Now, all we need to do is delete this column here. And we can just simply use the remove column button at the top. And then we can rename this column to zip code. So there you have it. There's three different ways that you can split columns in Power BI Query Editor. And of course, there's a few other options you have here as well. Hopefully you found this video helpful. And as always, we will see you in that next video. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.